Now to our big story, the break in a 1987 Fresno murder. Let's get right to Serena Sosa. She's in our news center with the big story. Serena. In the early afternoon of February 24, 1987, the body of a deceased female was found in an open field at the corner of Church and Fig Avenues. When officers arrived, they found a naked female who had been stabbed multiple times. Homicide detectives assigned to the case identified the victim as 22-year-old Jacqueline Denise Henry, a young mother of an infant son. Jacqueline had been reported missing by her family three days earlier. And today is a very somber, but yet a very exciting day that we can announce that justice has been served. Based upon evidence at the scene, detectives determined that Jacqueline had been murdered several days earlier in the parking lot of a church across the street, then dragged and left in the open field. Despite their efforts, no witnesses were ever located and the suspect was never identified. Uh, the detectives at the time were Fresno Police Detectives Joe Gilberto, who actually passed away in uh, 20, 2012, and Tommy Sanchez. In 2009, the case was reopened by a detective assigned to the cold case unit. After review, several items of the evidence originally collected from the scene and the autopsy that may have contained DNA evidence were submitted to the California Department of Justice Fresno Regional Laboratory for analysis. He reopened the case, looked at all the uh, evidence that uh, was gathered at the time back in 1987, and he resubmitted a lot of this evidence to the state, to the California DNA data bank. In February of 2022, the Fresno Police Department received a notification from the Cal DNA data bank identifying 71-year-old Carl Eugene Sears as a possible suspect. Since that time, homicide detectives have worked with the Fresno County DA's office, culminating in an arrest warrant for Sears. Mr. Sears, a registered sex offender on parole, was taken into custody on Friday, July 21st, 2023, and booked into the Fresno County Jail for murder. Um, I'm Jean Whittle, Jacqueline's oldest sister, and I just want to say that I thank Fresno Police Department, all the detectives, everyone that looked at her case, everyone that worked on her case. Reporting in the News Center, Serena Sosa, my TV 53 News at 8. All right, Serena, thank you.